Hey ladies and gents, Ro here and welcome to Nono Films. Today we're going to be continuing our iMovie tutorials and in this tutorial it's actually going to be more like I'm going to show you guys how I edit. I'm going to be getting two things done at once, uh, making a tutorial and uh, editing my project, what we're going to do. So I just recently, uh, which, well actually not just recently, I should have done this actually two days ago, but I'm going to open up my movie and I'm going to, instead of working on our iMovie tutorials project, I'm going to go straight to our Nono Films events and uh, down here we in our events we have the actual footage that I recorded here it's only I believe uh, what is it four minutes four minute video and then some extra clip on the back here I'm at the end and I'm gonna show you guys how I edit one of my updates and hopefully you guys maybe will learn something through this and I'll try to explain everything that I do as I'm editing it and uh, putting it into my project that way you, can, you guys can understand and uh, if you do have any questions that I did something I'll be sure to show you guys a tutorial or link you guys to a tutorial other than that I like I said I will try not to move too far well I guess I'm gonna be moving my normal speed um, I just I'm gonna try my best to explain everything that I do as I edit and I put up my update slash vlog together so let's begin now. By first, I always start off by <clears throat> actually playing my footage with the space bar here and, and uh, listening. So you're gonna hear me do that a lot. Um, you're, you're gonna hit me, get quiet, and listen to my footage. And I'm gonna, so I'm basically seeing what footage I'm gonna use and what I'm gonna take out. And whatever I highlight and then drag in, that most time that's the footage I'm gonna keep. And then there's like two two ways you can do this. You can either drag your entire project, and I think I just uh, I'm gonna let this load real quick. But yeah, you can do this two ways. You can either drag your entire project right straight into your, I mean, your entire event straight into your uh, project, like grabbing all your footage and then grab it and drop it, dragging it in there and then editing it from your project. Or the best way, which is the best way to edit, is going from your events to grabbing the footage you only need or the only footage you want and then editing the rest within your project. That's the way I prefer. So that's the way we're gonna begin right here. So let's begin listening and uh, just get through the tutorial. <laughs> Ro here and welcome to Nor Hello, is and Hello, hello is So I'm just trying to find the best starting point here. Hello, is and Hello, is and gents. Did you see, that's, that's the thing. When I edit, you hear something of mine. <laughs> I say like a lot. But the thing is, I, I tend to ignore the actual uh, audio. And uh, what I'm noticing right now is my audio is really low. It's because uh, my well, I have it my my computer on full blast, but uh, I need to actually adjust the volume of this before I actually put it in here. So what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go to adjustments, and uh, my computer is actually running really high. So I hope that noise in the background isn't gonna bother you guys. Um, I'm gonna boost up my volume all the way. I went to adjustments and then I went to my inspector. No, no, I went to my sound and I boosted up all the way to 400%, uh, percent, which is what I normally do because I recorded this with an iPhone and the volume just goes really low when you have it super far away from your face. Yep. Oh, wow. And I don't have any mic that I attached above yes. me or anything like that. Yep. So the volume is a little bit better now, so let's begin. Hello, ladies and gents. Hello, ladies and gents. Hello, ladies and gents. So I like that right there. Done finals, done with the semester. Get oh uh, well, I'm in summer. I consider it summer, even though when when school ends, I consider it summer. People say it's not summer yet, so we're still in spring and stuff. But hey, it's summer. If you're done with school, it's summer. Um, <laughs> okay, that's pretty good right there. It's summer. Um, <laughs> okay, I want to take it off just be before summer. I say the um. So I'm gonna drag until I get rid of the um. It's summer. You see, so that's the part I want right there. So as you can see, I drag it straight from my project. We start off with this, and then we end with see, and then we cut off the actual. And this is just right here. This is just my intro. Some of my beginning portions I have, like I put in the Norma Films title at the beginning, and this is my closing ending that I always have included in every project. So here right, we got the first clip. I want to remove this because I don't think I say anything important there. I know associate's degree you're like a uh, you, you beginner, but I don't, don't really know what people call me. What do people call me? You associator? You, you associator? 
Associator. Yeah, okay. Um. You associator. <laughs> you associator. So I'm gonna cut it off right after the associator. You associator. You. You. You associator. But I don't really know what people would call me. What would people would call me? You associator. You associator. Okay, right there, and just because I repeat myself right there, and I don't like when I repeat myself. Then we have this. Summer. But yeah, you guys, I finished my finals. And, and there we have like a cut, basically. And as you can see, the only parts I've included, which are, that's weird, this part is not highlighted. Normally it highlights this extra part, no, like showing you what part, like this here you see highlighted, it will be highlighted here as well, like showing you the parts I used from the clip. But for some reason it's not. Okay, let's go on. I'm happy to have that done, you guys. Happy to have that. Done. Happy to have. But yeah, I'm happy. But yeah, I'm happy to have that done. Well, that was a rude interruption. So what ended up happening, you guys? Unfortunately, some of my footage was lost. I was editing, and uh, my screen recorder cra crashed on me. So a QuickTime player crashed on me when I was recording, which is uh, not good. And uh, so I did finish. I did finish. Uh, grabbing all the footage and I was basically what we've talked about in the last past six minutes I've, I was basically doing what I uh, showed you guys as the Happy pause play and uh, grabbing the footage as you can see the highlighted parts down here at the bottom with the orange I mean the footage I grabbed actually and used within uh, my main project and uh, other than that and there's actually I added these this last few things at the end here this is like I'm gonna use this as a thumbnail and uh, just a few ending things and like I said this before this is just my usual ending and then this there's actually one other thing I was gonna do is because when, right here I say let me see um, like uh, yet yeah, after I basically put my entire project together I do additional edits like let's say like the sounds wrong in some places maybe or sometimes the lighting is way different in some places I might just adjust it because you can see the lighting keeps changing but since this is a vlog slash update, I really it doesn't the lighting really it really doesn't matter. It just it's just the audio that's that's the most important thing. I I probably say. But uh, right here, I actually do say I'm gonna have an image on the screen for you guys to see, and I thought I would fulfill that and put it up on the screen. I just gotta find out where I said say that, and uh, but yeah, other than that, um, it was really just crashed on me but I did explain most of how I edit my uh, vlogs at the beginning of the video I mean of this video so let me um just before it crashes on me again I am running on really low memory that's what I found out the main problem right now because I do have a lot of footage that I'm messing around with um, but for some reason I can't find this at all take a look here and, uh, I know so it's really like uh that's like one of my half my face dog and half half is really oh, it's right here. Speaking of programming, I don't know, did you guys watch any of the or iPhone 4? It's gonna be coming under that iOS 8, which is, looks awesome. They got like a health app that tells you they, which is, I think it's gonna be pretty cool, honestly, like see like OS ten Yosemite. I wanna say Yosemite, but it's like yes yesemite. Yesemite. it's like OS ten yesemite, you know. So right there. I'm actually going to put in an image because right over here um, I say that I'm going to maybe show an image. So I'm going to drag an image from straight from my desktop up here, right over here that I actually already grabbed from apple.com. So I'm going to drag it. I'm going to make it 10 seconds long. As you can see, I'm watching this timer here, 7.7 .7 seconds. Make it exactly 10 seconds or 9.9 .9 seconds. That's close enough. And I'm going to do a picture-in-picture -picture effect. If uh, this isn't down for you, it's just the adjustments here. And I'm gonna do picture in picture, and I do well. If it doesn't crash on me again here, please don't crash. Okay, I thought it was gonna crash. Okay, picture in picture. Uh, let's go the white border. Well, no, actually we don't really need a border. I'll do a light one with a darker color. That yeah, looks better. And then the actual cropping itself, I want the entire thing. So I'm gonna do crop to fit. I'm gonna do something like like this, because the main part we want the Yosemite. Yos Yosemite. I'm probably still saying that incorrectly, but and uh, let's uh, listen. Yosemite. Here. Uh, I don't even think it's an animal. I think it's like I, I probably 
probably saying it correctly. I might have a thumbnail here in the center or some up here. So you see, this is where I say I might include it. Thumbnail here in the center or some up here of it. That way, I that way you guys know what I'm talking about. And you see, you can't really see that. And I'm actually shorten this to over here more. 15 seconds exactly. And you, we want people to see it, so I'm going to expand that and put it closer to the corner here. And that way, when I say it's going to be in the corner here, and I, it's in the corner. And then people can see it. And now that's basically it, you guys. I'm going to have a link in the description for all my tutorials, all my tutorials that I've done previously. Um, they're there's actually like 40 of them I, that I just recently looked at. I'm like, wow, I did a lot of tutorials. Um, but yeah, be sure to check that out and let me know if you have any other questions below in the comment section. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you guys for watching. Later. Let my life be the proof, the proof of you.